Hey, what's up guys? Sam from Cubi Studios here, and bringing you a let's play in a, I guess, classic, maybe, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! The Dawn of Destiny. I found this, uh, I understand it's very old. I found this at, like, a pawn shop downtown, and, uh, I thought you guys on my channel would absolutely love a throwback like this, considering it's still backwards compatible on the 360, so... Yeah, I can make a Let's Play in it. I'm really excited to be doing it. It's 1 a.m. I finally finished studying for my exam. I'm like, you know what? Fuck it. I can give this a shot. It'll be great. Apparently they're showing off all the classic characters. I'm really excited about this because it's the OG generation. None of that synchro bullshit. None of that XYZ bullshit. Fucking classic card play. So I'm excited. Fortunately, it was already used, so did not find a Winged Dragon of Ra in the uh, collection, so okay. Haven't started up this game yet. I'm just like live recording, like I just put the disc in and we're going. I'm excited, hopefully you are too. I like couldn't believe my luck when I found this, and it was only like 10 bucks. I was a little shocked by how like high the price was still. I'm assuming dual single is the... Uh, does it matter? Is it the same thing? Is it a different difficulty or do they have a different deck? Okay, forget it. Part one is gonna be fucking the duel machine. Remember when this got fucking blasted by Obelisk? Gah, speaking of Obelisk, sup Kaiba? The duel machine is surely enough to deal with someone of your limited strength. Fuck you, dude! I beat Millennium Duels one time. If you somehow manage to beat it, I might consider dueling you. Dude, Kaiba's the best. Boom. I, uh... Hang on. What is this? No, how do I select to not be first up? Ah, here we go. Uh, second up. I didn't own this game as a kid, unfortunately. This game came out back when I was, like, still, like, dependent on my parents to buy stuff. So, I did not have... Ah, shit like, the money to buy it for myself, so I never got it as a kid, and, like, my parents wouldn't buy it for me, because they're like, you don't need the card game, you already have, like, thousands of the actual cards, you don't need to have the virtual ones, too, and I was like, oh, that's bullshit, and, uh, okay, so I didn't get shit for a hand here, Cosmo Queen is in my deck? Jesus Christ, okay, play this in attack, I guess, it's a halfway decent card, what's, what did you play? What is that? Okay. Is this a field? I don't... I didn't make this deck. Uh... Card info. Spellcaster type monster equal to this card increases its attack and defense by 300 points. Okay. I didn't make this deck, fun fact. This is the starter deck. Is this a spellcaster? Okay, it is. Uh... I guess we're gonna summon this in attack position. And then we're gonna equip. Oh! Jar of Greed, who the fuck cares? P -p what? Made noises? Wow, if I could chain all the Jar of Greeds you want, I guess. That's weird, it doesn't do this in like the newer games. That's fine though, I think it's better run. What is this thing spinning in the middle here? Does that do anything? Alright, let's continue my turn. Who am I going to activate it? Of course my card. P -p -p Stop making a reaction after every card I play, please. Enter battle phase. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, no! Alright, well, I guess he got to activate all of his cards that turn. Good for you. Why didn't he what about main phase 2? Did that not exist? Oh, it totally exists. Can you sacrifice first turn? That must be an effect of that monster. Or maybe the rules are different because this game's older. I'm only aware of, like, the rules that I played with at, uh, fucking Millennium Duels. Like, I'm only aware of, like, that set, I guess, because it's been so long since I've played. I guess the older rules might be different. That would make sense. Oh, no. 
That, okay. Why didn't, you could just destroy all those a lot faster. You didn't need to take that much time to do it. I guess I'll end my turn. But anyway, so we're gonna like be going through this campaign without Marshmallow, because I don't have that card yet. I just have these. And that is not good. I also apparently don't have a fucking magic or trap card. Holy shit, there's animations? What? What just happened there? That's not even... The new games don't even have that. Was that real? Okay, why is Cosmo Queen a fucking two sacrifice? You're shit. Uh, so is that. It was a 900 attack, right? Yeah, okay. I need to put out something with a thousand. Mm, I could just destroy it, but something tells me it has a good card effect thing. <laughs> Probably not, actually. Like the newer generation, it's funny because uh, the newer generation, like normal monsters, are like irrelevant, but they're actually important right now. Okay, so the animations aren't that sweet, but did really need to shake that much for 200 life point damage. I don't think that was that big a deal. Alright, so yeah, I never played this game as a kid, I really wanted it, but I had too many of the actual cards, I guess. But I remember a really good friend of mine that lived down the road had it, and uh, he needed me to play it a lot, so we would play it a lot, so I could help him beat it and stuff, and that was fun. I miss those days of youth. Alright, I'm just gonna fucking put this in a tag position. I don't play carefully at all, by the way, if you're new to the series, and like, my channel. I'm not good at this game. I don't pretend to be good at this game. And, uh, I just attack. Like, whenever. I'm balls to the wall all the time. I could've attacked the other one, but that's fine. What the fuck monster do I have? I like that they're all, like, shitty early 2000 animations, too. It's really funny to me. Granted, it, is, it, didn't, it doesn't need to be sweet, but... The fact that there's animations at all is really cool, considering the new ones, like 5Ds and Millennium's Duels, both don't have animations. I was shocked to see, like, they actually have a 3D model for the card. That's kind of cool. I'm not sure what that necklace thing is that fucking, like, clamps in and changes the, uh, thing every turn. I could probably... I could probably summon that now, but I really don't want to. Uh, Cosmo Queen? Because Cosmo Queen sucks. Almost completed the turn. No, thank you. I really need to modify this deck. But I know I don't have any other cards besides the default ones, so... What's the point in modifying it right now until I get decent cards? This has been a really long duel. Like, it's simple, but... It's been long. It's an... It's just an ant. Do I not have an effect monster in this deck? Like, come on. Work with me here. Ah, uh, okay. I just miss Marshmallow. Uh-oh, that's an attack position, so something tells me it's gonna take stuff out. Okay, I mean, I guess. Ugh, it looked, that looked so creepy. I guess Cosmo Queen needs to come out, unless I could draw a 15-point monster here. Oh, I speak of the devil, I did draw an effect monster. What's its effect? This monster may attack your opponent's life points directly. Okay, go fuck yourself. That's not a good effect. Okay. I mean, I guess. The car, the actual card animations themselves kind of suck. So I guess that's a compromise, but... I don't live in as much fear. Like... Ugh. Cosmo Queen looks kind of ugly. Rough. Did you just bring out another Mystic Tomato? I hate you. Dual Machine, you are the worst. Does it show me how many cards I have left? Ah, 29, okay. Six, wow. So I'm working out how to play this game slowly but surely. I mean, it's it's exactly what it is. It's still Yu-Gi-Oh, but I just, oh, moved to defense position. It's just different, like, the layout, I guess. I'm not used to not being able to just read the card by hovering over it. I have to place another button. What is this? When your opponent activates Regeki. Regeki. 
that's dumb though. That only works for one uh, card effect. Like, what are the odds that that's what gets summoned? No. Like, get out of here with that. That's such a useless card. I would I will be removing that from my deck as well. Just because, like. All right, so this is gonna place out probably a third Mystic Tomato, I would imagine. Right? Ah, no. It doesn't show me what it placed though. What is this? Cyber Jar. What's its effect? Flip. It's a flip effect. Okay. I'm gonna destroy that then. Thank you. With my shitty thousand attack monster. <laughs> Boom. Ah, there goes another hundred. You don't need to say stuff every time you take damage, dude. Machine thing, that's fine. I'm gonna set this just in case. Alright. Proceed to main phase two. Let's set this just in case, because why not? I don't think I have like any other trap cards in my deck so far. I actually am playing blind, like, as you saw. You won't get that intro in the later videos because you don't need it. I just wanted to actually watch the intro, but as you saw, I literally went in blind. I didn't even, I didn't even look at this deck. Probably a rookie mistake, but I really just don't. I don't have the concern right now. Enter battle phase. Let's attack you. Hey, good call. I'm gonna try and win this duel and not attack with uh, Cosmo Queen until I get all the monsters out. Might have been a good. Oh no, I don't think so. Actually, I think this like what's its effect? Flip brings all my stuff back to hand, right? Oh, it's just the, my hand. I don't give a shit about my hand. I'm worried about the monsters in the field because I'm I'm mean, gonna win this turn anyway, so I'm actually not worried, but. Hey, good duel, duel machine. Victory! Oh, did you see that? I won. Kai was upset. Not bad, but don't celebrate too quickly. You only defeated the duel machine. I only defeated duel machine one. Oh, which one do you want? Uh, fucking all of them? Okay, I already have Obelisk in a lot of card games. I have Ra. Slifer I never get to see, so let's take Slifer. And Slifer fucked me. These are useless. I don't want any of those. What are the other two zeros? It goes one, one, zero, zero. What does that mean? Okay, fuck it. We're gonna take on Duel Machine 2 next. Live the life. It's time you realize the true power of the duel machine. Okay, thank you. I appreciate that. I won again. Duel machine's off to a rough start by losing the hand toss twice in a row. Or not the hand toss, the Rochambeau. Oh look, it has a different background because it's duel machine too. Turns out I have another monster. Uh, or another trap card of my deck, excuse me. Obviously I have a monster. Oh, I just yawned, Jesus. Sorry about that. What card are you? Attack 1300, that's a decent card. That's defense 2000. Uh, I could take it out with Lord of Lamp. Lord of the Lamp, that would be way funnier if it was just Lord of Lamp. This isn't a sacrifice, is it? Okay. This turn, I think I'm going to trick it into a losing life points by just setting that. It'll attack me next turn, I'm sure of it. Well, that's gonna be my plan. Is to just passively let it do some damage to itself and then destroy it with Lord of Lamp next turn. We'll see how that plays out for me. Harpy Feather Duster. No. Oh, okay, just got rid of dice, whatever. I guess I could have activated that. I really just didn't know what was happening. Oh shit, I'm gonna lose. Maybe. How powerful is this now that it has United We Stand on it? It has to be face up monsters, remember. Oh, it didn't even attack. Never mind, I guess it's not as aggressive as the uh, newer game AIs. 2100, so it can for sure kill my uh, monsters now, but it doesn't matter. I'm gonna set this and then just hope, like. Oh, good. 
Gravity Bind is actually a good card to bring out in a second level duel. Four or higher get, can attack. Especially with uh, fucking United We Stand. That's a good combo. Oh shit. Is that Man Eater Bug? Oh damn. I'm actually gonna get fucked here. I, I can't stop this. Thank you. I haven't lost life points yet, but here we go. This is where it begins. Wow, man eater bug looked dumb. I'm gonna lose. Oh shit, 3,700. This is the second duel. Merciless. Merciless, this game is. That's fine. Uh, oh good, I got Killer Needle. What can you do? Oh, nothing? I don't think. I can't even take out. I mean, I can make it lose 700 attack by attacking, like, uh, man eater bug. What does this have? 1600. Okay, I can't take that out by anything. Uh, I guess I could summon Lord of Lamp to just not do damage, but take damage for me and like get rid of this. So this would lose. How much would it lose? Lose 800 attack. Okay. That's reasonable. Oh shit, and then I accidentally set it because it's got a weird... That doesn't matter. I've lost this duel anyway, really. Because I can only block one hit and not, like, I can't summon anything, so... That was a good effort by me. I assume I don't get new cards if I lose. Alright. Oh, fair play. You could have won this turn if you didn't put that monster in defense position. Rookie mistake, duel machine. I lost on the second duel. Are you kidding me? It doesn't matter. I lost. Whatever. I need a decent deck, man. Okay, just beat me. Whatever. He won. Woo. Oh, Jesus, man. Okay, attack me directly with that, like, 4,000-point monster you have now, I'm sure. Okay, you showed mercy. You just beat me with Man-Eater Bug. Shit. Little Kaiba, please. That's a smug look. What? My power. I don't have power levels right now. I just have the fucking rookie cards. Oh, draws must be the third. I figured it out. The first, this or the first block is how many times you've dueled it. The second time is how many times you've won. Third block is how many times you've lost, and the fourth is how many times you've gone to a draw. <laughs> See, I'm smart like that. Man, I got this with the shitty ass deck I'm being forced to use. I got this. I can't wait till I get decent cards, but that's gonna be forever and a day. Didn't it summon uh, fucking Stone Warrior first turn last time too? Alright, that's what this is. Yeah, Soldier of Stone, excuse me. What is this? Uh, fiend and Spellcaster type. Is this Fiend or is this Rock? Or what is it? Earth Rock, okay. It's... I, can su I can play this then and it can actually help me out. Do you? Oh, cool! Like, oh, look at the background. Check that out. It's like I'm in space. Okay, so obviously we're gonna summon this. Gemini Elf's probably the best card in my deck right now. As horrible as that sounds, and it's not, it does sound horrific. Let me tell you, you're not missing much if you think that's uh, a horrific thing. Alright, we're just gonna end the turn. Hopefully I can start like really pouring out some monsters here. Big plant looks so ugly. Don't summon something and then put United We Stand on it. Okay, good. God, I would have been mad. The last thing I want to deal with right now is another United We Stand. Okay, it doesn't show me the attributes of the card. This is a spellcaster, so I can summon this. Is this fiend? Yeah. Okay, so currently Phantom of Dwion is going out. This is Spellcaster, so that's going out. Fiend. Are all my cards Spellcaster or Fiend? Yeah, okay. 
This card's going out then. It's got the highest attack. <laughs> Enter battle phase. It's weird how like low these attacks powers are and like how detrimental they are right now is because all cards are really like low attack. I'm so used to every card, like if you don't have 1800 attack, you are worthless. So, that's interesting. It's a huge change of pace from the, uh, the newer games, which is refreshing actually. I think I liked this style of play better, because it kind of just makes the smaller monsters worth more. Especially Marshmallow. It made Marshmallow a fucking devastating card, which is why I loved it so much, probably. Place this, I guess. Right? That's a good turn. That's a solid turn, is what I was saying, really. Oh, zero defense. Brilliant. Set that down. I think that was actually probably Fiend. That probably would have done pretty well, right? I don't know. You got this little, like, magician thingy. Well, I still have monster to attack with this, right? Ugh! Oh, why have you yelled up a storm here? Okay. God. In before comments of, yeah, it's because your video is boring. I know it. You know it. But sometimes I'm funny. Uh. So let's see. I think what I'm gonna do for into the next part, part two, which you should turn in for, because oh yeah, there's gonna be a part two. But uh is like they have dual machine that little picture above uh their thing so i think what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna put a webcam feed above where it says sam you know so you can see me because that would be cool i think what is it? okay level four and higher can attack right yeah so this can attack good call sam i didn't even summon a monster ah shit not a good call you fucked yourself uh, main phase two, because I definitely still need to summon something, correct? Ah, uh, no, I already did this turn. How am I going to deal with that? With gravity bind and Gemini elf not being able to attack, how am I going to deal? Because I don't know if I have a card in this deck that destroys monsters like that. I don't think that exists. Or, not mon monsters, uh, trap. Trap cards. Okay, only level 3s can attack, so I guess this is going to have to go up on the field. But, I mean, enter battle phase, only these two can attack. The same, but might as well attack the card that got set, just so he doesn't build up too many cards. Like that, get off the field. Complete the turn. He's, good, he's currently stalling me out, and that's uh, not okay. But, alright, we're taking the advantage here. Not really, god. Bad dice. Does this lower defense? Attack and defense of all your monsters. Oh, okay. I actually don't think this is enough still. Like, because if I lowered this by 600, it'd be 1400, and I don't think I have either of these are 1400. Alright, so save that until I can get something with 1400, or something that would destroy that trap card. Because other than that, I don't think I can win. And that would be sad. Turns out I can't move around the field. No. Without uh, it being my turn. Like, look at other cards. It's kind of lame. Oh, that can attack directly. Ah, oh, wait, I have a full field, though. Enter battle phase. We might as well be attacking, right? No harm, no foul. No, wait. Uh, no. Don't do that, I'm gonna kill it. When it's in defense position, it doesn't matter if I, like, how much more my life points are. If they're already more, then it doesn't need to be more. Yay, that thing looked weird. All of these monsters look really weird right now. If I could summon this, that'd be great. But I can't. Because then I could at least have something that I would attack directly. So hopefully I lose a monster sometime soon here. Or I could just play something in defense position again. 
God, so this card, this deck's just based on like trying to draw me out, I guess. But can you? How many cards do you have in your deck? 27. 27. Nope, you can't. You will always have less than me. This card has changed from attack position. Shuffle your own deck. Worthless, okay. Why did I enter battle phase? Oh, right, because I wanted to at least take out whatever was just placed. Ha! Ah, and I did. Armored zombie, good for you. Complete turn. Come on, you're more than halfway dead. Give it up. Or do the exact same thing again. This is gonna this is a war of attrition, and it's gonna last the entire duel. Oh wait. Never mind. If I can activate this then it would make the other trap cards irrelevant. Right? That's what that does. As long as this card... Yeah, all the effects of all trap cards are deactivated. Okay. Then I can activate that next turn. And then I can start attacking. Because Gemini Elf, while Gemini Elf's still on the field, I can take that out. Oh, beautiful. Can I activate this? Suck it! No. You are irrelevant, Gravity Bind. Prepare to get fucked, Dual Machine. I am ready. What does Dark Energy do? I haven't seen this before. A fiend type monster equal to this card increases its attack and defense. Uh I guess you're my highest fiend, so I guess you're gonna get dark energy. So, like Papa Shut up. No. Mm, enter battle phase. You need to take out the stone creature. <laughs> Don't keep asking me to activate stuff. I hate when it asks me to activate stuff. I'm gonna take some small risks here and just attack with like lower level stuff and hope that pays off. Because I really don't need to do much more Okay, the animations were cool for like 30 seconds. I'm already over them. Like, wow, that's cool. But went the first time I saw it. What did you... I don't know what that effect did and I don't care. There goes more than half. Or maybe not more than half, but a decent chunk. I'm gonna win next turn for sure. Just powering right through these dual machines. They ain't shit, let me tell ya. They ain't shit. Main phase two. A little upset that I have to be blue and the other team's purple, considering that's my favorite color, but okay. Let's just enter battle phase right away. End this. End this charade. No. Don't activate equip play trap card because I have a thing that disables all trap cards. Have you lost your mind? Yay. Okay, I don't know if it's like the, the thing again. Like, pick one of the three god cards. Heh. <laughs> the cornered rat bites the cat, eh? I wonder how you will do next time. Shut up, Kaiba. I didn't know he's like my favorite character. Alright, so in the comments... The comments I'm going to request for you guys is to find which of these three will give me Marshmallow. Like, who will give me Marshmallow? I don't know if they have specific cards that drop from them, but find out and comment. This is the god you're going to pick every time because you want the card Marshmallow. Let me know because I need it. I don't know if he exists like yet at this time, but like if it's a bit invented. Now you will be tested with the duel machine. I've already dueled it twice. It's not tested anymore when you win every time. Well, not every time. I actually did lose the second duel of this video and the second duel of this game, but that's irrelevant. Uh, so yeah, find me Marshmallow. Let me know if he's in this game. If he is, if so, I want to do some shit with that. Okay, what's Needle Ball's effect? 
Flip, you can inflict a thousand points of deluxe at the cost of two thousand of your own. Nope. This destroys. Ah. I'm gonna set that again, because that'll be useful. And I have nothing that can attack Vorse Raider. That's a good card. So I'm gonna set that in defense position and hopefully do 100 points of damage, I guess. I can't believe the effect of Needle Balls to do. I will pull almost every card from this deck, probably. This deck's not good. Like, I'm gonna make it from scratch, or at least I'm gonna try to. Did you summon Vorse Raider again? What's this? Another 1900 attack monster. Increase the attack of the defense by 500. Any monster that destroys this card must decrease. Ah. Uh, okay. Um. I don't really have anything I want to set. Yeah. Anything we get destroyed, and that's currently being my placeholder, so. Uh oh. Is that Jinzo? That sucks. Jinzo is not a card I want right now. I think it's Jinzo anyway. I can't really see. Okay, yeah, it is. Shit. Jinzo is not a good card to have out early. Granted, its effects are relevant because I was going to activate something like that, but. <sighs> no. You're not helping me. Alright, so I'm gonna lose. I guess I might as well just speed up the process and get attacked and activate its effect, because I'm already gonna lose. I don't think there's anything in my deck that surpasses the 2400 of Jinzo. And I can't activate anything that, like, automatically destroys it, so... We're gonna have to just forfeit this one, basically. That's not good. I don't want to have to do that, but... Yeah, whatever. I'll just throw it in the towel on this one. Because I can't win. Why would you wait to attack with Jinzo for the second one? Hmm, can't do anything with this one either, so. Set, I guess. Man, this starter deck is rough. Like, I get at the beginning you have to be like, oh, give him a shitty deck, but like. Does ev so, this is the formula of every Yu Gi Oh game, right? Like, here's a shitty deck. God. Did I lose yet? No? I had to check a chest text message. Thought I would lose by then. Yeah, I'm glad you switched your other attacking monster in defense position to drag this duel out another turn. Witty Phantom. Let's activate this just because I said so. Yay, I did stuff. Yep. Alright, so that was a rough duel. That was a rough patch, but we're okay. We're gonna recover. I'm gonna be like... 3 for 5 for this video, hopefully. Ah, good. Flip all everything into attack position now that you've already won the duel. It's a good call, you like mangy little prick. And then you attack with a monster that doesn't just kill me in one turn when you have more than one monster that would just kill me in one turn. What a dick. I'm already off to a bad start with this game. It won't be a long time, Kaiba, shut up. I would like, I want an image like what Kaiba had, but instead of blue eyes in the background, and obviously instead of Kaiba there, let it be me and Marshmallow in the background like that. Cause I'm telling you, how awesome would that picture be? But okay, I digress. I don't know if anyone could even make that if it's possible. If someone could like draw a cartoony version of me. And then the faded, like, monster card in the background. That'd be awesome. But is it doable? 1,200 attack. That's okay. I think I can beat that, right? 1,400 attack. What is this? Select like and destroy two of your monsters. Just like destroy one of your opponents. No thanks. Uh, let's do Royal Decree. I'm probably going to get fucked here. I imagine, though, if it has Jinzo in its deck, it's probably not too heavily reliant on trap cards. Oh. Ah, okay, it's just Jar Greed, I don't care. Wow, you get to draw a card. No way! That shouldn't even be allowed. I actually think that's banned, or maybe it's Pot of Greed that's banned. 
Whatever. Doesn't matter. I'm gonna win this duel and call it a night, because I am tired. Man. Alright. I wish I was the purple one. I'm not. What is this? Mystical Space Typhoon. Oh no! Okay, I lost the two-pronged attack, which I wasn't even confident about using, so no big deal there. It's an attack position, which means it's going to probably activate and destroy one of my monsters, but I don't care. I mean, I do, but I'm not going to be shocked. Oh, fuck, it is 1800. Great. I need Gemini Elf to stop that. Or to somehow get Cosmo Queen out. Oh, good. I got Anti-Regeki. Which I can't use anyway, because... I... This... No one probably has Regeki. And I can't use Trap Cards. Well, at least that card's gonna take a hit for me. This game's hard, man. Did you skip your battle phase, really? And okay, I guess. Mystical Elf, you're useless to me right now. What I require is offense, not defense. Because apparently this game is not very aggressive and will wait you out. Understandable, because who would fucking do some of the moves that it does? Half the time. What does this get me? A 600 attack, wow. Against 1500 and 1800. Nope, not doing it for me. Good defense position, man. Alright. Tainted Wisdom. What is this? Just shuffle my deck? No thanks. Alright. Set you. Oh, what I could have done. It's too late now. Whatever. I'll... Actually, I might not be able to do it next turn if it conducts the battle phase. Because I need, I could summon Cosmo Queen now. But only if it doesn't attack. Okay, I didn't. Let's see what I can do here. Maybe I can get Queen out. Uh, let's get rid of you. And you, I guess. Just because I like Miss Thick Space Elf to be there to defend me. Enter battle phase. Let's take out who's got the lowest attack. 1800, 1500, 1900. Well, let's take out this actually. Because I'll do 1000, and that gives me a better chance in case Cosmo Queen goes down to like come back. Because I only have one 1900 other monster in this deck that could like defend me if Cosmo Queen goes down. So let's get rid of the most powerful ones first. Ah, defense position. Good call. You know the AI is on the run. Alright, who's my next powerful monster? You. Alright. Enter battle phase. I could have flipped. Nah, I won't flip that actually. Uh, can I take out. Alright, let's take you out. And then you can attack one of the face down cards because it's less guaranteed than the face-up ones. Although granted, he's my heavy hitter, so I really shouldn't risk him like that, but... Or her, excuse me. It says Queen literally in the name, Sam. Good call. But I think I can take it down. Uh, mm, nope. I'm not gonna want that. I'm gonna want this, though. I keep getting that card. Do I wonder if I have more than one in the deck? Uh, shouldn't this stop that from activating anyway? Whatever. Not a big deal. I mean, it is a big deal, but not that big a deal. There's only 800 defense, which means my lowest attack monster can attack you. And the next two are just kind of like piss shows. Like, okay. Nope, don't inspect. Just attack. You're going to attack this one. 1200. Oh, just 50 more. Clutch. Just barely destroyed that. Man, does that brain thing look creepy. Get rid of this. 
I guess that's the same bird thing. Next turn, I should be able to start doing some damage. Hopefully. We'll see. I mean, I could kind of have already done damage, I guess, but not really much at all or anything significant. I should be able to get another monster out this turn. Hopefully it's something decent. Not really, but... Okay. Just in case the defense is high, I don't want to lose any life points. Wouldn't have mattered, but... It's always worth, like, the potential. Like, hey, don't fuck this up. You know? I still have two more. I like when it automatically goes to the next card with the arrow. It doesn't in this game. That kind of bugs me, but... What are you gonna do? It has fucking battle animations, so they had to cut the uh, automatically go to the next phase feature of the pause menu. And I can't complain about that, really. What I can complain about is how tired I am right now. I can't even focus my eyes. So I'm really trying to wrap this up. Luckily, I'm starting to put the smash on the duel machine after it's already beat me once. Ah, I can put this on somebody. Let's do that. Activate. I think my spellcaster is a, a fiend, but I'm not going to attach it to that because it's already a really high number. I think my spellcaster is a fiend. No, I mean, I think queen is a fiend. Is it? No, it's a spellcaster. I was wrong, so I couldn't have equipped a dark energy to it anyway. But it would have mattered because the thing is such a low attack. Okay, attack. Victory is upon us! Shit, so it's two turn it's two attacks away still. It'd be nice if I didn't have to watch another animation, but I do. Alright. Get you going. For the victory, the little ant that could gets my victory, because I made fun of it and I feel bad. I don't feel bad, but I did make fun of it. Not bad, but don't celebrate you only defeated the dual machine. Who's next then? Uh I didn't get shit. Who didn't I get? Ra, I don't think. Ooh, Slate Warrior. Ra treat, treated me the best. Okay. I defeated all the dual machines. Do I have to be, defeat the dual machines a bunch of times? Weird. Okay. Alright then. That's gonna be... Wait, I need to save. Give me that. Sweet. Alright, you guys. That's gonna be the end of this video. I hope you enjoy me diving back into this older series, uh, not Decade Duels, uh, excuse me, Dawn of Destiny. Uh, let me know how you feel about it, give me a comment, maybe a share, hopefully, if you did like it. Remember to subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you around, guys.